Well, for the very first time, Safaricom reported revenue for its mobile wallet m -Pesa declined by 2.1% to 82.65 billion shillings in the period ending March 2021. The reduction was linked to an order by the Central Bank of Kenya to zero-rate fees for transactions worth 1,000 shillings and below. Katins Brenda Kirubo reports. In a bid to cushion Kenyans from coronavirus-induced economic hardship, the Central Bank of Kenya agreed with financial institutions to waive fees on transactions for 1,000 shillings and below. This applied to person-to-person -to -person transactions, bank-to-M-Pesa wallet, and M-Pesa wallet to bank transfers. Safaricom also zero-rated pay bills and tills for hospitals and dispensaries and as Lipana M-Pesa transactions below 1,000 shillings. M-Pesa revenue declined 2.1% in the period under review. Perhaps the most impactful was facilitating reduced cash handling through a temporary zero rating of all transactions below 1,000. Over 1 1.7 billion transactions valued at Kenya shillings 4.4 trillion were zero rated during this period. From 1st January 2021, the order was lifted and there was a significant recovery in the second half as revenues grew by 10.1%. We saw a lot of pressure in the first half with some recovery in the second. And we are encouraged by this momentum as we move into the new financial year. Despite the revenue decline, total M-Pesa transaction value grew 58.2% to 22.04 trillion shillings, while volume of M-Pesa transactions grew 29.8% to 11.68 billion shillings. The business added 3.4 million one-month active M-Pesa customers, growing at 13.6% to 28.31 million in the period under review. With Safaricom's push towards ramping up mobile money, the firm is now placing emphasis on this business line as voice revenues continue to flatten. Brenda Kirubukiti, News.